All right. Court's now in session. Honorable C. Rollins and Trones presiding. Session for the Civil Rules and Trolls presiding. You may be seated. Okay, we have two uh, separate cases. First, uh, I'm going to start with uh, Ming Ming Chen, K17 CRA 109. And we have a translator here. And do you want to stand and raise your right hand? We solemnly swear or affirm that we will truly and accurately translate the proceedings uh, this morning uh, that are set before this court. I do, Your Honor. Thank you. Thanks. And uh, I have a, uh, it looks like a waiver of, we're here for a preliminary hearing. It looks like the defendants, this defendant wishes to waive that, uh, that hearing. Is that correct? That's correct, Your Honor. Right. And, um, now, Mr. Is it Kowaleski? Kowaleski, Your Honor. Kowaleski, and you are here and also with uh, Attorney Wong's office. That's correct. Margaret Wong and Associates from Cleveland. Attorney Richard Drucker is also in the case, but he is in a federal trial in Cleveland today. Okay, thank you. Okay, now, uh, Ms., I'm going to direct this to Ms. Chen. You have um, talked to your lawyers. And you had a right this morning to have a preliminary hearing where the state would have to show with substantial credible evidence that this crime, these crimes were committed, that you probably committed them. Do you understand you're giving up your right to that hearing in exchange for information that could be helpful to you in the future? Now, uh, has anybody made any promises or threats to get you to waive your right to this hearing? Now, the matter then will be bound over to the Star County Grand Jury. They will have to make that same probable cause determination, so you're not completely losing it. And they will be the ones to decide. Yes. Need the interpreter request to slow down a little bit. Okay. Thank you, Your Honor. Where did you leave off? Okay. It did matter when we bound over to the Stark County Grand Jury, and they will decide what charges, if any, to issue against you. Okay. Do you have any uh, questions? 
Okay, is there anything uh, further, Mr. Collette? Uh, Nothing further. Okay, Yang uh, Zhao. Okay, now you speak great English, correct? Yes, Your Honor. And I have uh, also, we were here for a preliminary hearing on your case as well, which was the complicity to felonious assault and to uh, commit murder. And uh, you wish to waive the preliminary hearing on behalf of your client, first of all. Thank, thank you, Judge. Judge Joseph Gorman of Gorman, Larsky, and Pearson Akron on behalf of uh, my client, uh, also president of the Court of Honor, is attorney Jake Wilf of Ken, who will be assisting um, uh, in the defense of, of my client as well. Uh, my client, Your Honor, has executed a waiver of the preliminary hearing form that you have provided to us. He's aware, Judge, that he could have a hearing this morning and have you listen to evidence and determine whether or not the National Prosecutor's Office will bring forth enough evidence to establish probable cause. He's going to waive that, Your Honor, and my understanding is we're waiving that in exchange for the National Prosecutor's Office providing us uh, what discovery they have to date in this matter. And we've talked to our client about the advantages of that, Judge. Therefore, he would waive. I'd ask the court to inquire of him. Okay, thank you. Uh, Mr. Zhao, you understand that you, uh, I'm going to go over this with you again, but you understand that you did have a right to a preliminary hearing where the state had to show with substantial credible evidence that uh, these crimes were committed, that you probably committed them. You understand um, you're giving up uh, your right to that hearing this morning in exchange for information. Yes, Your Honor. Okay, has anybody made any threats or promises to get you to, to, get you to uh, waive your right to this hearing? No, Your Honor. Okay, then in your case as well, the matter will be bound over to the Star County Grand Jury. They will have to make that same probable cause determination and they will decide what the final charges are against you. Okay, uh, do you have any questions? No, Your Honor. Okay. So we would reserve... Any further? I'm sorry, Your Honor. We would reserve the right to address uh, bond uh, modification at the appropriate time in front of this Star County uh, Court. Okay, and that, obviously, this court will lose jurisdiction uh, later on today as soon as the cases get bound over and then uh, Common Police Court will take over as you know. Thank you, Your Honor. I appreciate that. Okay, uh, this court then is in recess. Thank you, Your Honor. All rise. Just down the hall. Okay, great. Thank you.